Alrighty everyone, last batch of ghosts, and now we're headed to Mars. There are 18 ghosts on Mars, and 15 of them can be found in patrol mode, so load up patrol mode and let's go. Ghost 1 is in the Barrens, the first area that you spawn into. Go down to where the Vex and Cabal are fighting. In this building, you'll find a ghost sitting on a box. From there, you're going to head to the Hollows, so take that main road down. When you get to this building that leads to the Dust Palace, head inside. Jump on this light and then... Jump on this light and... Jump on this light and then jump up to the top level. Walk around onto the protruding platform to find ghost number two. From here, we're going into the Dust Palace. When you get into the big room with all the stairs, go up a flight and turn left. Jump on either box sitting on the stairs and then jump onto the window platforms. Go towards the middle and you'll see a ghost sitting in the middle. Grab that ghost and continue through the area by going up these stairs into the overwatch. When you get to the big red wall, turn left and the ghost is underneath a desk next to a computer. After you grab this one, head back outside. You're now going to go to the Drift. Continue on the path you were going on when you came to the Hollows and you'll enter the Buried City. Keep going left and you'll enter the Drift. Scale up the hill until you see this tree on the left. In the tree, on a branch, is your next ghost. After you grab that ghost, head back to the Buried City. You'll need to get on top of this awning here, so jump on this panel and then jump on the roof and walk towards the sign itself, and a ghost will be waiting for you. We'll be heading into Freehold Station from here, so jump down and go into the super dark area and then go to the right. You'll see two TVs mounted on two pillars, front and back. On the back one, there will be a ghost sitting on top of the monitor. A quick note, for some reason this ghost doesn't appear for certain players, for example, the people that I'm playing with right now have no ghosts on their screen and they did not get them at a previous time. I don't know why this is the case, so if it's not there for you, I don't know why. Sorry. We're almost done with this area. Head farther into the station until you hit Tharsis Junction, the area with all the Vex. Go past the first gate and make a quick right. This ghost will be sitting in a corner. We're going to head back to the Barrens now, and since we're so far away, it's just going to be easier for you to go into orbit and then come back down. From the Barrens, we're going to head to the Scablands, so go to the right along the path this time. When you get to the Scablands, go under this small Cabal bridge, and go to the left immediately after going under the bridge. The Ghost will be sitting on a platform. Head back the way you came, and go towards the Valley of Kings, like you're doing the Black Garden story mission. Eventually, you'll hit Giant's Pass. When you start to see this area with a lot of Cabal, look right and find a tree. The ghost will be sitting around the roots. Continue towards the Valley of the Kings, and follow the path to the back of the area. When you see this first spiked rock on the left, start walking forward towards the cliff and you should see a ghost just sitting on the edge of the cliff. After grabbing this ghost, turn around and head up the cliff where all the buildings are. This clip is pointing at where we just were for the previous ghost. Jump on top of this building, and then onto the rocks and go to the left. Jump onto this next batch of lower rocks, and there's your next ghost. We're gonna head back to the Scablands now into Firebase Rubicon. Go under the bridge and head off to the left. There's a small cave to the left near the construction light. On the left side of the tree at the end of the cave is the next ghost. Continue through to the Iron Line, which is that second big area of Cerberus Bay 3 with the big door. What you're going to be doing here is jumping up onto the blue pipes and then jumping up to the area above it. Turn around and you'll see a pole with a very small platform on it. You should jump to this one next. Above you, you'll see another small platform. Jump onto that one, and then look on the rock next to you for your next ghost. Continue through the Iron Line to the Trench Works. This is where you fight the three Cabal Guards during Cerberus Bay 3. 
When you get to the big open area, hug right and eventually you'll see a ghost sitting in the corner. These are all the ghosts that you can find in patrol mode. Head back into orbit and load up the Garden's Spire story mission. Fight through the entire mission until you get to the very end right before you put the eye into the pillar thing. Under the big pillar, you'll see ghost number 16 laying on the floor. Now, load up the Black Garden story mission. As soon as you walk through the gate to get into the Black Garden, turn around. The ghost is on top of this statue, so you need to climb the walls, rocks, and trees to get up there. I'll just let this clip roll to show you how I got up there. Finally, work your way through until you get outside after the big staircase. Turn right and head straight as far as you can along the cliff. There's a tiny ledge you can jump down to and that will be your final ghost. Anyway guys, those are all of the ghosts. I highly suggest you go read all the grimoire cards that you find from said ghosts, as they are all a very interesting read. Thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.